And at the end of the day, honestly, any bowl works. Because you know what you're going to do? You're going to sit there. They all do the same thing. Tibetan, Tibetan, Tibetan singing bowls. You see all this right there? I didn't know better about that bowl when I first started. You see all these engravings? That's for the noobs, okay? Newbie people, it's okay. Let the people, like this, it's okay. I'm okay with these little bumps, but I already know. Come on, man. When they need extra, oh, buy me, I look special. It's the plain ass bowls that the one I recommend you getting, okay? Plain ass one. It doesn't have, like, but you want to spend, bam. You see that 83 buck right there? Maybe, maybe you don't want that much. But you see how this thing is plain, Jain, simple? That's gonna be better sound. Cause it's focused on sound instead of other stuff. Oh man, it bought me home. Oh man, it bought me home. Oh man, it bought me home. You can chant that. Okay. You have to see what is your budget. Like for example, bam. You can get a whole set. Okay, you see bullshit writing? Okay. That's sell to Westerners. Cause Westerners are like, oh look, writing is pretty. I want that. So they up the price on, right, local, right. So, for sound healers because here, here's the thing if the best bowls don't have any graving engraving like the best bowls have no engraving why the hell should you get a low quality one with engraving let's go to the these have engravings because you know why they focus on bullshit western people okay look at that oh flower of life i have that tattoo on me i should buy it that's outside the chakra inside your body okay all right so all this right there does now look see bam antique this is real deal. Plain as, right? Plain as hell. That's just a bowl. Boring. 250 year old bowl. Okay. Right. This. Okay. But we don't need to buy fancy. To me, I mean, you have to see what is your budget and what are you planning to do with it. Okay. Now, if you're looking for more, the bowl that I have is hundreds. So that 89 to 120, that's a good price to get a decent bowl. So I would get at least an 8 to or 10 to 10 inch. You don't want anything. You want the vibration. Okay. So you're looking around. I think there is a filter here. Minimum. Let's just go 70 to 120 okay bam boom pow now if you like the one with engraving it's fine too but my right you see that's a minimal oh money bought me home that's classy and when you see this symbol it means they made it during a full moon and this one looks good sometimes you see somebody do like a, they call a full moon ritual on a bowl but the engraving looked like doo-doo like very bad quality or just kind of like yeah it's full moon so we charge more Okay, you see, buy one. Let's see. Buy uh, eight inch. So it's pricier. Quality of seven inch. All right, okay. Skip, skip, skip. So, okay, that's that. Maybe, maybe. Over your price. Okay, this is decent right here, 8 inch. Solar plexus. Now, if you want to see what quality bowls look like, let me take you to a website. It's called Bodhisattva Singing Bowls. Okay, bam. Bodhisattva, master quality. This is where I would buy it. This is not a normal, this is not for the most. This is for like, okay, you, you in and you're, okay. This is different. I always, number one, let's see what special deal they have, okay? Bam. Three bowls, 250. Too much. But look. That's, that's worth it, man. That's worth it. <laughs> The word there, right there. Okay. okay, that's one. Okay, this four twenty. Okay, I don't know if that if that. I'm I'm not sure if they're trying to give you a clue or you know. I don't think so. But maybe. Like, oh, dude, four twenty. That's for us, man. A bowl for a bowl and a bowl. You know what I'm saying? Twelve inch bowl. Okay. Oh, wait, is it? Yeah. Yeah. 
That's what I'm talking about, man. There's power. Get to the shopper. Like this one. Same. See the similar tone? Just get a different mic. Wait, have you ever had a singing bowl before? Okay. I don't know if you, if you never had a singing bowl before. I think you should start with basic one, like not on this website for real. Like you wanna, I don't want you like. I think you'll love it, but I think you need to respect. You know, you need to like, but it's up to you. If you have the investment, like, the, well, first it's not gonna be here. Amazon. Dot com. Welcoming kill shot. Nice to see you. There's writing on it. Boom. No. See? No writing. Bam. Cost more. You see the trend? See? Writing. Westerner shit. This? Okay. See? No shipping. Okay, right. Uh, this is clo- This is as close. You can get a set of three Tibetan bowls. Instead of seven, you get more high quality. And that variety will inspire you to get on it more. To play more. Right. So remember, one basic. Uh, wow, that is a one of the thinnest singing bowls I've ever seen. Actually, that's a hundred bucks. And at the end of the day, honestly, any bowl works. Cause you know what you're gonna do. You're gonna sit there. They all do the same thing. Really, I'm showing you all this, but like, I'm just showing you with what I would do and get. Right? Maybe that's a bit. Old, you know. I I think with your price, you can get one big one. Large Tibetan singing bowl by him. See, okay. So the modern bowls that are quality are gonna be highly polished. Because they're selling, right? Are gonna be highly polished, right? This is good, okay, but overpriced. Okay, bam, you're in the market right here. Straight from Kathmandu. Bam, right here. 10 inch Himalayan singing bowl. Hand beaten. When their English is not good, that means it's from the motherland. When their English is too good, you already know. Somebody get in the middle, okay? Hand beaten. Make magical tones. Like, that's not even appealing. Magical tones. You know that's from Mother Shambhala Arts and Craft. Right? So it's showing you it's the same. That, right? Get better lighting. Sure. You can probably sell more. But here's the thing. They have shitty lighting. But look at the reviews. Bam. That's a, that's a sign. Not bad. Okay. Okay. Lighting not that great. Hand Tibetan, handmade Tibetan singing bowl by Shambhala. Art and handcrafts are imported from Nepal. This bowl is 10 inch diameter, 4.5 inches height. With an antique finish, the bowl comes with it. A suede wrapped wooden mallet and a ring cushion. You want to see my new singing bowl? Let's see if there's video of the sound. I'm sure there is. Oh, see? I told I told you. So it doesn't look like the is it, it's the exact same bowl. It's more shiny. <sighs> I get it. They're selling to beginner. I get it. They just got first singing bowl. I get it. She whacked it like a freaking whack a mole, man. I'm like. Ah. It's okay. I mean, it's first singing bowl. In 
enjoying it. Good deal. This is a good deal. This good deal. It's good deal. It's good deal. It's good deal. Oh God! I've never handled a gong or a singing bowl, but I have played string instruments in my life, and I am very used to vibrations of music. And no, I am sens sensitive to sound, but to speak words about oh, this impossible. There are no words for this. Experience. None. I had some vague idea that I wanted a certain sound quality, and so I opted for a large boy, and then said, "Well, it's up to the universe. What comes? I trust that what I need or would be good for me." Will find me in terms of sound. The first strike, bang, with the red-tipped striker mallet. Tears arose. I felt all this energy of the past few years of pain and sorrow that had been like a lump stuck in my throat, stuck in the energy field of the body, literally. Loosen, and the tones that are released, I can't even fathom them. It's overlapping depth in sound. If I use the timpani style mallet, it does not generate the same tonal quality. I am glad that the red tip one came with the bowl. I happen to like. That crisp gong sound. Then, it's as if the bowl goes into singing mode all by itself, and the low tones make you feel like you are in a monastery. There's absolutely no way a human being could hear this bowl and be other than open to let go and. What is not sounding with clarity? That's all I can say in words about this experience. Striking it in various pl places causes all sorts of various depth and tonal quality. It's all so wonderful, like a gong. If one holds the bow in hand. The resonance penetrates the entire palm. I will be placing the bowl on my spine, where I had surgery years ago for that reason. God damn! Shit! What the fuck? This is a YouTube video. I can make a YouTube video on this. You want me to finish the whole thing? It blows my mind that I get to own something like this. When people in Asia, who who way more spiritual, less materialistic, and so meritorious in humility, probably would never be able to afford something like this. I hope all who practice the spiritual asanas get to practice with something like this profoundly religious. Sacred. It's akin to being in a cathedral. Okay, I think somebody was on mushrooms or LSD, and they just decided. To, my God, like, all right, I'm on LSD right now. I'm on mushroom. It's akin to being in a cathedral below the ring of huge bells. One doesn't have to be religious to feel gravitas of. Hey, maybe life is more than me. And what I think or assume, this is like cathedral bell. The tone, no, audio clip, can capture them. You have to feel the sound vibration personally, even as it rings from the satin pillow. And yes, it sits very nicely on that. The sound waves. Do resonate 
as not only sound, the deep tones sing all by themselves when the ball is struck with the longer striker that usually is associated with a smaller singing ball. That tool makes the ball sing and sing and sing when it's struck on the side with it. And the singing ball, the singing tone is deep. It definitely goes to the base chakra and bone in a way that I, that I never could have planned. This is the ball, Kata Jelly. The resonance of the tone. Feel the vibration of the singing bowl from Tibet. Can you feel the deep resonance running through your soul? Feel the vibration of the Tibetan singing bowl resonating into your mind and soul. Boom, pow, cam. Right, see, delivery November 8th. Ah, it's not too far. Okay, the fastest delivery November 8th. The latest delivery December 5th. But I mean, you can always look around. This is questionable. 8 inch bell metal Tibetan Buddha singing bowl musical instrument for meditation with stick. I can't tell which one is better just by looking at it. Can you read another review? <laughs> okay, this is a bowl that I would never... I would, okay, they have Tibetan symbols on it, okay? This is a brass bowl. This is how... Right? It's like, that's his characteristics, right? Now, I prefer the other one. I can love this one. But I just don't prefer, you know what I mean? It's a, it's a tool. Okay, okay, so 42 bucks, that's way overpriced for this bowl. But, right, you just pay for the size. Oh, it's six inches.